Chinese who care about our leadership transition most. Anyway, say that the United States or any other country said we care that most. No, Chinese we care the most. We care about our future. But how we understand this leadership transition? I, when I, I remember I talked with uh, foreign experts, you know, several years ago, maybe three years ago, I remember, we said, oh, we, do you think, how do you think of the Xi Jinping in next term? You know, I said, Chinese foreign policy will be, as a member of the ambassador last night mentioned, that, will be more assertive. Of course, because you're right, your power is rising. This, of course, this is natural. The second, the Chinese government still doing almost follow that even Deng Xiaoping's the principle of foreign policy is Taoguang Yanghui in some cases. In when we're talking about Chinese international environment situation. So that means case by case. That's been foreign policy. So many Chinese people I think uh, have very high expectation of this Sabada. And later I think we uh, many are satisfied with the result. And Xi Jinping and, uh, and Li Keqiang now, just yesterday, Li Keqiang delivered a, a, a talk uh, to the ministry level, Gan Bu, and uh, said, uh, if you cannot, if you, are, we do, if you don't do more reform, you should be responsible to that, you know, you, you have to be responsible to the historic uh, effect, that means. So that, that very heavy pressure from the central government to the local Gambo. So I'm looking forward to more changes. And the Chinese people, I think more like me, I think we are still promising that China has another good uh, future. Yeah. Then at least in 10 years, I guess.